The U.S. could see a massive disruption at East Coast ports in October as dock workers are threatening to strike if contract demands aren't met in 60 days. The International Longshoremen's Association, or ILA, is the union representing more than 85,000 workers. The union is contracted with the United States Maritime Alliance. Their current contract is up in the next few months, and port workers want more out of their proposed renewed contract deal. They've officially filed notice that if an agreement isn't met, then a strike is on the table. 36 ports across the Atlantic and Gulf would be impacted by the strike. More than half of the cargo shipped to the U.S. from around the world comes through these ports. According to Moody's ratings, it's unlikely a strike would actually occur just because of the major global ramifications that would follow. Global trade and supply chains would take a hit and in turn throw economies into chaos. These workers' significant role in keeping goods flowing is leverage for the union, but the Maritime Alliance says its renewed contract is a giving one saying it has made several offers since we first began substantive contract discussions in 2022. Our latest proposal would provide industry-leading wage increases, boost employer retirement contributions, offer new employees higher starting wages, raise employer contributions to local benefits, and continue to provide premier health care coverage. ILA released a statement in response. When it comes to the master contract negotiations, let me be frank, we are very far apart, particularly on the economic issues. In fact, we're at an impasse. The propaganda coming from the United States Maritime Alliance is just that, propaganda, likely the work of a PR firm trying to spin the situation in their favor. The White House says they are monitoring the situation, but are so far not intervening in negotiation talk. But if a deal isn't reached when the strike date approaches closer, it's likely a larger force would come in to hammer out a deal to prevent a detrimental workers' strike just a month out from the election. Hey, thanks for watching our news update. For more stories that matter to you, download the Straight Arrow News app today.